so this room is very like, green and yellow pastels the other room is dusty rose or old rose and some of them are more neutral this house is really nice it's a brand new one here in bf resort village it's got four bedrooms four toilet baths a powder room a two vehicle carport staff quarter service area you name it and everything you see is included so if you're interested if you're liking it so far make sure you watch till the end of the video to see the rest of the house tour Today we have a brand new house and lot for sale in BF Resort Village. But first, make sure you hit like, click subscribe and click on the bell so you get notified for whenever we release new YouTube videos. We're on Facebook so make sure you hit like and see first and follow us on Instagram at presolo underscore official. My name is Julia and welcome to another presolo open house tour. So from the road, this is what you will see and you already know it's going to be a handsome home right so you have lots of vertical lines horizontal lines lots of textures dito pa lang sa entrance you can see that this white wall is textured whereas the gray one is smooth and then you have a semi gloss finish for the black and then you have matte black frosted white then you have some tan it's a very interesting and very textured facade and the interior is also going to reflect that but as we go inside Please do take note that the vehicle car port is opened by a manual gate here on the right side and then here in the middle section we have the pedestrian gate. So as you step in here, first thing you will see of course is your main entrance. But on the left you have a garden which is quite manicured, very um, or rather landscaped. Ay, hello po, magandang hapon. Sensya na. Okay naman po, magtutour lang ko kami. Sensya na. So, we have access to the... Ay, opo. Sige po, sige po. Opo! Sa kabila, opo. Ayan. Oh, sorry, <laughs> saglit lang po. Ay, sige sir, mag-ano lang kami, magtutour lang. Okay, so, you have the pathway here. Ano, okay lang, dyan lang ko kayo. Okay lang. <laughs> so, you have... No open, ha? No. No open. No. Masyado mabili. Ah. Ano eh. natin ng konti. So babagalan natin ng konti, guys. Sige, sir. Try natin yan for this. Oh, so let us know, guys, kung if you want us to slow down. Magsalita at mag-tour. Okay. First hand comment yan. So comment down below if you guys agree. Ay. Salamat, sir. <laughs> Hindi niyo na kailangan mag-comment tungkol doon. Comment na lang kayo kung kailangan kong bagalan yung tour at kung kailangan kong bagalan magsalita. Okay, so here we have the pathway leading to the side of the house. Again, very well manicured, very landscaped, and very nice. Okay, and then on the other side, sorry, dito lang sir. 
<laughs> you have the vehicle or the two vehicle car port. Ang ganda rin ng pattern niya sa floor. You can clearly tell that you can fit two vehicles here and two SUVs, mind you, comfortably. Hindi siya masikip. You have high ceiling and some details on the ceiling as well. You have some storage there on the far right side, but everything else is basically this textured wall as well as the beige. Okay, now we have the main entrance over here. Solid wooden door with glass panels on either side. And we cannot take shoes in, so I am going to wear these tiger slippers. Okay, so as you enter, here we go. You will be welcomed by your living area, dining area, as well as your kitchen. But let's focus on the living area first. So you have vertical wooden slats over here, a stone wall over there, and then again more of the vertical slats. And you have some lighting fixtures, and then you have fixed windows as well as awning windows like this one where you can open and then just let the breeze in. My screen naman na nakasama. And then you have high ceiling over here that opens up to the second floor. And spoiler alert, you have two stories. Then walking to this area, you have the dining table set with the plastic and everything. So in case you guys are wondering, everything is included. As the sign says, what you see is what you get. Everything, even I believe the decor is included. So that's what's nice here, ready to move in na talaga. As in, nothing, wala na kulang. And then, uh, on this side, <laughs> you have the sliding glass doors that lead out to your patio, which already has seating, already has decor. Again, everything that you see here is included. Included The AC, the decor, the phone, the lighting fixture, the seats, everything, appliances. All right, now here we have the kitchen with a bar. So your bar can fit, uh, right now it has two stools, although you can technically fit another one. Pero maganda ng maluag. You have some lighting over there, and then the kitchen itself is an L shape. You have cupboards up top and below. You have your refrigerator already here, and these are also included, of course. Everything that's built in is already included. So your kitchen system, completo na. Even the ones out in the service kitchen, which we'll see in a bit. And then you have some storage over here, and then your uh, microwave and your oven right here. Okay, so you have a door at the end of the kitchen, which will lead you to your covered daily kitchen or your service area. You have a counter, you have a gate over there by the side, and then this is the staff quarters. Already comes with a built-in dormitory-style bed. And then this, well, I can show you this one. This is a pantry, so it already comes with built-in shelves. And then you have your sink over here, as well as your built-in stove. Usually, ha, hindi nila ginagawang built-in sa service area. But this is already built-in and fl almost flush. Then you have some storage here, still with the kitchen systems. With the drawers and all. Oops, sorry, wrong side. And then under the sink, tiled. So it's easy for maintenance. Kasi minsan tumutulo naman talaga yung mga ano, pipes, diba? So at least you know that kahit mangyari man yun, not that it will happen, but if it does, it's gonna be easy to maintain. This is, of course, already included. That's your washing machine. Then you have your sink in the far end. And if you'll notice, you'll have these black pipes running along the ceiling, right? Those, or that, is where you hang your laundry. Sakto nga ayo, meron na siyang sections for the hangers. And then this is the toilet and bath for your staff. Gandang tile say it's all diamonds. I mean, diamond pattern, not made out of diamond. That's gonna be really expensive. <laughs> okay, so that is the service area. Let's go back in. And now you can see the perspective from this side. Hello. <laughs> all right, so actually, we're going to go there. But we're going to Ay, okay, never mind. <laughs> So over here, we have bedroom number one. So this is obviously on the ground floor, so you can turn it into a granny room. And dami tao ngayon sa shoot, no? I know. Okay, so again, bedroom number one, you have high ceiling, 
you have down lights or pin lights. And then again, everything that you see is already included. So the paintings, the plants, of course the built-ins like your, um, well this is more for entertainment. You can have your TV here. Or if you don't want a TV in your room, because not everyone likes a TV in the room, but there's no salam in the vanity if you want. This is your wardrobe, and then some shelving. And then over here we have the ensuite, toilet and bath. Look how nice that is. Okay, there's so many things, right? Dito pa lang sa ensuite. That's what you're hearing. So you have your sink, white sink, with the gray countertop. You have your toilet with the beige here for the as an accent area for the toilet but the rest of it is gray right here your flooring is matte black and then you have the beige here again and the gray and then the look for your products looks like wood but it's tiles Shampa, it's a shower area kailangan pwedeng mapasa, right so this is actually tile but ang ganda ng pinili nila tile it actually does look like wood at least you know from a distance but but you know, it's tiles. Tiles. So, again, easy to maintain. Hello. <laughs> and then before we head up, although I might want to say that, or I might want to just point out that the color palette na pinili nila, right? Like everything just looks so harmonious. Even if it's damage, because usually, diba, you pick two or three, maximum of four colors, para hindi magulo tignan, at least visually. They have a lot of textures and colors going on here, but everything looks so good. Like the powder room. So you have this sort of, is this Silurian blue? I'm not sure what kind of blue this is, but it's a matte blue paint and it goes so well with the sink. So much character going on there. And then you have your toilet over here with the bidet and everything. The ceiling is lower because this is under the stairs, but it feels so cozy. Also, it smells great. I know you can't smell it, but it smells great. And you have accent tiles over here behind the toilet. It's already included. Lovely piece. Goes so well with the rest of the colors in here. It's the kind of powder room na proud kang sabihin sa guests mo. Ah, the powder room is just under the stairs. Okay, so that is it for the ground floor. Before we head up, though, check out the lights for the stairs. Usually, it's just you know, very angular, but they stylized this, stylized this one. Right, let's head up. Oh, and if you haven't already, make sure you hit like and click subscribe. And if you agree with what Sir said earlier about um, how I conduct the tours, like if I, if I need to be slower or anything really, comment down below, let us know. Okay, so as I head up the stairs, there are a lot of things that I noticed actually. The first one being, check out the curvature of this one. So the handrail, not just the handrail, but also this section. So I don't see that very often. It's very art deco. In fact, I, I, this house feels like a very like modern or like toned down art, modern art deco vibe. That's, that's what it feels like. And then check out the ceiling. That's also quite unique. So you have these wooden accents on the ceiling where your very modern chandelier is in or is attached to. And then over here you have a white wall where you can display your art. So this one already comes with, so you can keep it there. Or if you have more art to display, well, you have a lot of wall space. Okay, so second floor, this is the top floor already. And you have these areas to go to. So let's go through here first. And this is bedroom number two. So even here on the second floor, you have high ceiling. The bedrooms have cove lighting and down lights. And then Everything, again, is already built in. You have your vanity over... You have your vanity over here. You have your entertainment desk over here. Oh, I didn't notice this earlier. So this is obviously for the TV. And this is for whatever it is that you need. Maybe your uh, hair dryer, etc. Depending on what you need for this desk. But it's USB. So a lot of appliances small appliances and gadgets these days hindi na kasama yung power brick diba diretso na siya cord dulo usb so you can just use that no need for the power brick itself okay so you have your wardrobe over here and then some shelving and storage and this is the ensuite toilet and bath so the tiles used here are different 
so I thought the, the dark gray you have the blue mosaic tiles over here the sink is different you have your toilet your enclosed shower space but you still have the wood like tiles for the product nook it's really nice it's a nice touch of it. everything is consistent but also very different and even the headboard area so you have horizontal lines over here in a somewhat muted yellow color this green uh, pastel actually it's more of pastel this room is more of a pastel colors basila. right next to that we have bedroom number three now, this one is the master bedroom and you have your built-in entertainment shelf over oh correction this is the desk this is the desk and it's up to you if you want to place a pc over here or what have you that is the entertainment shelf and then this is ideally where you would want to place your bed you have a corner window these two are fixed the rest of these these four you can open as an awning window and they already do come with a screen we passed by a shelf which we'll see later on the vertical slats here are also different it's in a darker color but of course the style is the same as the rest of the house but not cohesive and then here you have a walk-through closet so you have hanging rods open by the way and then these are closed storage another open uh, hanging rod area and then your vanity at the end of the hallway again still high ceiling and then over here you have your suite toilet and bath with an enclosed shower space this time with a honeycomb mosaic tile pattern in matte it's like matte concrete or matte wood but it's tiles again you have the nook for your product you have your toilet your adorable sink it's very textured in certain hawaman and then you have a bathtub here again with a product nook right next to it the ceiling is also not plain so apart from the cove lighting and the down light this area has a bit of a pattern. It's very simple. It's basically just um, manually done pattern. It's effective. Makes it, yeah, it, it's not plain. So something as simple as making lines on a smooth surface instantly transforms it. Okay, so we have this open area, right? But we're gonna go here first. So this is bedroom number four. And this time, it's, although it's still a bit of a pastel, it's more of an old rose or dusty rose. So you have this much space, you have your accent wall over here. This is your vanity right next to a window, a set of windows. So these are two awning ones, again with the screen, so you can just open them and not worry about anything coming in. You have your entertainment desk or just your desk, again, it's up to you if you just don't want the TV here, but legitimately a bag in case you need it to. Lots of storage, your wardrobe your shelving and storage and then over here you have the ensuite toilet and bath with your sink toilet and enclosed shower space you also have some storage or shelving over here and can i just say i'm cute not plant it's also pink it matches the rest of the room there's something about negative space talaga that really captures my eye Okay, so as you go out, you'll notice that you have more storage over here. There's more than outlet. So actually, you could put a seating setup here if you wanted to. But it's a small office if you want. And everyone can share in it. Share in it. <laughs> but this is the office office. I love it. There's a dedicated space just for working. And it's enclosed. And I love the colors too. You've got matte gray. You've got matte beige. You have wood like tiles for the flooring, actually for the rest of the second floor. A desk, oh, the desk, uh, what do you call this? A drawer. And then, of course, space for your office chair, preferably with wheels so that you can get around easily. But yeah, it's just a nice and enclosed space. Kasama na rin yung aircon, all of the design uh, elements. Actually, okay, I don't know if you can see it. So, vertical slats, sorry, ba? but the grains have a bit of a pattern. It almost kind of looks herringbone like Indian saja I think but or maybe it is we don't know but whether it is or isn't it looks nice you have windows of course that you can open up to let the air in and still you have high ceiling just like the rest of the floor and then over here you can see down below your guests 
who are hanging out in the living area. At night, this chandelier is gonna look really nice as well. And since you have a corner window, pag bigyan yun na may construction na yada sa kapit bahay, but people are gonna see the chandelier that you have here thanks to that corner window. Nice and aesthetic. And then at the end of this hallway, you have access to a balcony at the front of your property. It's covered, which is great, which means you can put some seating over here, just hang out whatever time of day. But especially nice, I bet, during the mornings or afternoons, basically golden hour or even nighttime and having a drink or two, a nightcap to end the day with your family. Speaking of ending the day, we are about to end this tour with a recap. So you have 213 square meters of lot area and then 312 square meters of floor area split between two stories. Four bedrooms, four toilet and baths because all of them are en suite. And then you have a powder room under the stairs. You also have a separate staff quarters with their own toilet and bath, a service area right outside of the kitchen, and a covered two-vehicle car port. And this gorgeous brand new home comes with everything that you see in here, down from the accessories to the built-ins, obviously, and the, the fixtures and the AC, the appliances, everything. So if you or anyone you know wants to see this place, again, this one is in BF Resort Village. Make sure you send this video to them, or if you want to see it for yourself, send us a message or go to our website at www.presello.com. Invest in your future. Invest with us. Invest with Presello. Hey guys, if you haven't already subscribed to our channel, make sure you click here. And if you want to see more house tour videos, click right here. And we also have this new thing called Working Lunch with Priscilla, where I and a few random people talk about a few random things related to uh, real estate. So if you want to join in on the conversation, make sure you click right here. <laughs>